Hi friends, it's Miss Tina. I was inspired by the material that Molly sent out this week about the mushrooms and also the photos of her hike and so I thought I would print out the handout and maybe create some mushrooms with some different kinds of materials. So I'm going to use some watercolor watercolor paper. Remember that's thick enough, heavy enough so it can absorb water. There's my brushes and water. I'm also going to add some some table salt. You've probably done this before where you sprinkle the salt onto the wet watercolor. It makes a really fun effect. Another kind I'm going to try is with the pastels on black paper because it shows up so brightly on the black paper. Um, I have a couple of crayons for some accents. Then I think one more that I'd like to try is with some cut paper scraps. Other materials that I have in case I need them, a rag for my hands, especially with the pastels, and then just some extra pencils, um, a sharpie for maybe some lines that I might want to add. I have a couple little of my little fairy garden things here just they can watch over us as we work. Okay, bravo. So one of the first things I like to do before I get started with my watercolor illustration is I look at the scientific drawings with all of the parts labeled and I also really love to look out on Google Images and right here I have a mushroom botanical drawing, botanical meaning of plants and hopefully I'll get lots of, oh yes, I'll get lots of drawings that other artists have made of mushrooms and I'm going to go ahead and click on images I'm sure you've used that feature a lot. I love using Google Images because, and I love looking at other artists' renderings because it helps me see in different ways. Bravo. So there's a mushroom and then if I clicked on it, it was over here and I clicked on it and made it bigger and I can either click on that one f further Botanical illustration, watercolor, mushroom stock illustration. I can click on that website to see it bigger, or I can scroll down to get some similar images. So I'm getting lots of inspiration right now. Bravo. Okay, let's get started.